Hope Watchers are back on the road. And today we are in Brussels. Why Brussels? We are from Belgium. So today we're gonna show you how you can visit our capital in just one day. This is the monument of Belgium, the Atomium. It's a construction of nine balls. These nine balls represent the nine provinces of Belgium. And it's possible to visit five of the nine balls. These balls are huge! Belgian fact number one. Our country is divided into two halves, a French part and a Flemish part. In the French part, les gens parlent français, and in the Flemish part, spreken de mensen Nederlands. This is Mini Europe. Here you can find all the famous, most known buildings of all the cities in Europe, but in a mini version. So basically it's like traveling to Europe, but all in one place. Feeling like a giant! Belgium the weather sucks. The sun may be shining but it's fucking freezing. <sighs> Much better. We are on our way to the center now. So we are doing now uh, everything by foot and pieces by car but there is also a subway that you can take. There are lots of buses and things like that so you can choose. Belgian fact number two. Belgium is a monarchy, so it means that we have a king. So behind me you can see Le Palais Royal de Bruxelles. If the flag is hanging above the building, it means that the king is somewhere here in Belgium. If the flag is not visible, it means that the king is abroad. Oh, <laughs> I'm wondering if they're already considered my pink world plan. are the Belgian specialty, Belgian fries. We got it from Maison Antoinette and a lot of important people ate here. Back on the road again! Basically, it's just a man peeing. And of course, there's also a female version, the Jalaka Piss. And a dog. Belgian fact number three. Our most known specialty is chocolate. And believe me, there's no better one. <laughs> We are here now 
at the Grand Market, so this is the central square of Brussels. Um, you have all these nice buildings, really old, really fancy. And you can eat and drink a lot here, so we are gonna find a waffle now, a Brussels waffle. Well, Belgium already has a lot of specialties, but there is another one, the Brussels waffles. Yay! Well, after the fries, the chocolate, the waffles, it's clear that if you come to Belgium, you have to prepare yourself for a really healthy lifestyle. Not. <laughs> If you're walking through the streets of Brussels, you will see a lot of houses painted like this one. And if you follow the walk through the streets of Brussels, you will discover more paintings like these. <laughs> so we are here now at the Galerie Royale Saint-Hubert. So basically it's like a gallery with a lot of expensive shops like these. But it's really nice to see it and really nice to shop, so... So as you guys know, we have already been to China, so to come back in those Chinese atmospheres, we're gonna eat in a Chinese restaurant now. Chinese food! Our day in Brussels is already done. Um, it may seem a lot that we have visited, but everything is filmed in one day. So it's really possible to visit everything in just one day. But now it's time to go home.